today I am showing you guys how I organize my closet in the winter and slash fall. I realized that I probably should have done this video a while ago seeing as winter is like halfway over but uh, seeing as if you guys follow me on my Twitter you'll know that my closet broke so uh, my dad kind of like redid my closet so I kind of like organized it in any way and I really like how it turned out so I thought I would give you guys some tips on how I organize my small closet uh, in the winter and then I think I'm going to do one in the spring and summer when I take all of my uh, stored spring and summer clothes that are in the basement but this is just all my winter clothes so here on the door I just have a couple of bags um, if you saw my room tour you know that my bags are hanging on the back of my door like my front door of my room um, but these are just kind of like other ones and these are all kind of the ones that have like a more Chanel-y type vibe to them and they have like the metal chains and stuff and like the quilted material this one is from Aldo and then I have two other ones this one's just like a really small um, little aqua colored one and this one is from Urban Planet and a pink one and this one is from Forever 21. When you open the doors to my closet, um, I have some stuff on each side of the door. So first I guess I'll talk about this side. Um, I just have some um, like crossbody bags hanging from like Northwest and Coach and like these random ones from Aldo and stuff and like a fringe bag for the summer and then I have my umbrella hanging on one of these command strips these are great for hanging things on the closet door or even on the wall just because they kind of like they're really really easy to take off so I just have my umbrella hanging there and then I have a um, some clutches it's not clutches some um, wristlets from coach and stuff hanging on this little um, white wrap as you can see all these bags are hanging on these like white metal hooks and they're all kind of connected and they just kind go over the door and I got that from the dollar store so it was only one dollar and then I have this one silver one that holds this red bag and I got that at the dollar store on the inside of the store I also have the uh, white metal hooks from the dollar store and it just kind of hangs all my belts I rarely ever wear belts I really should wear some more often uh, but most of them are just kind of like leather from like American Eagle or like Forever 21 or something like that um, as well as this giant red bow from H&M a few holidays ago if you guys remember that um, and then I have this uh, random lacy um, scarf and these two um, crossbody bags from Tommy Hilfiger and those are hanging on a metal hook kind of like I had one on the other side of the door with the red bag and then I have another one of those command strip ones with this little coach wristlet just because it's white so I didn't want it to get too dirty so I kept it on this side and I also have this in my closet which is really really random but it is this like masquerade mask that my mom and I made for my uh, when I was in like grade 11 in high school for like a formal that we had so I just kind of keep that in here because I didn't want to throw it out because we spent so so much time making it and I think it turned out really really pretty so I just kind of keep that there for like no reason okay so on the very very back end of my closet it kind of hidden in there are just a bunch of dresses I don't usually wear dresses that much in the winter I kind of wear skirts and tights more than I do dresses so I just kind of stuck them in the back there um, in the summertime I have a lot more dresses that I wear so it's in a different section in the summer but for the winter I just kind of keep them stacked in the back there because I only have a few of them and then this whole section here are just kind of like blazers and like little coats that aren't actually coats but like uh, blazers and what I mean by that is kind of like stuff like this that are kind of like little jackets but they aren't like warm enough to wear on their own um, as well as like some little uh, like tweed ones like this and stuff. Okay so after all the little jackets end I just kind of have a few winter like plaid pinstripe shirts that I like rarely even wear. Um, here so then I have some like like three different plaid ones um, then I have a few pinstripe ones and like a checkered one um, and a couple more pinstripe ones and just like a jean one and these are mostly from like Hollister and Abercrombie and I have my jean Michael Kors shirt which is like one of my prized possessions. I use that one all the time. It's really, really cute. I really, really like it. Then I have my chiffon shirt collection. And as you guys know, I love my chiffon shirts. So I have like this giant stack of like white and cream ones. And then I kind of organized it from like the really, really white ones to um, like a little bit off-white. And then it goes into like creamier colors like this one. Um, and then it goes on to the ones that have like black accents on it like this one. How it has like the black on it. Um, and then all the ones after that have black accents on it um, and then it goes on to the, the patterned ones um, and then it goes on to like darker 
cream colors and then like powder ones with that and then like off-white pinkish kind of colors which goes off to the pink ones and like the orangey kind and like the hot pink and the reds. After the reds then I have the navies and the blues and then obviously the blacks and the printed black, so I have like a leopard print one and like a skulls one because like who doesn't have a skull shirt, I've worn it like twice. Uh, and then I have one of my favorite shirts which is like this black philosophy shirt with like these little puppies on them and it's like the cutest thing ever and I love it. After that I have two like nice pants nice material pants with um, like a little zipper on them so I have a navy blue and then I also I also have a little like plaid one which I love I can't wait I got this this year in the winter and I still haven't worn it yet and I'm so excited for the spring to come so I can wear it with like some heels I'm really really excited about that okay so then after that then I have like this random stand of flats so then I have like some like plaid flats and like ones with like patterns and like pointy ones and like my coach um, running shoes and then like it goes all the way down to the bottom and then after that then I have my skirt the way I like to organize skirts is by using the one that has like the four hangers that way it takes up less room in your closet and I like to organize them kind of like by colors so as you can see this one kind of has like a red type theme going to it so I have a red one a black one with like black on it and then a navy blue and then I have one with like yellows and like beige kind of color and then I have some that have more like patterns so this one is like a black and floral one and then I have some that are like green and patterned ones so that's the way I kind of do that okay so after these skirts then I have all of my coat and stuff there in the background so I kind of go in color order as you can tell I kind of organize my closet by colors so I have a um, my blue plaid one and then I have all of my blues because those are the colors that I use the most often um, and then I have the black ones and then um, gray and then brown and it goes on to beiges and then army greens white and then a red one just because I don't wear the red one like ever just at Christmas time really so I just kind of stuck that into the very very back I feel so small standing in this corner like hi I'm over here anyway okay so on the very very top shelf I have a bunch of like heels so that's kind of like boots and stuff that I wear in the winter time and then most of them are like boots like Jeffrey Campbell style, style boots and um, I do have a few regular heels up here but most of them are kind of like down there and a lot of them are stored for the summertime because I don't really wear them that often as well as I have some shoes um, beside my bed if you saw my room tour and I also have some by the door just because I couldn't fit them in here so at the very very top that whole thing is just shoes and then on the second shelf I have sweaters so on I'm just gonna move that and down there I have like the green ones and the uh, yellow just because I only have one yellow so I didn't know where else to put it so I just put it with the greens and then I have the reds and the pinks mostly because I only had a couple of red and a couple of pinks so I just kind of put them together um, and these ones are just like the black ones so um, just black sweaters and a few cardigans and then this one is kind of like the beiges I'm gonna switch now um, these ones are just kind of like the beiges and uh, like light pink color which looks beigey to me so I just put it there and then um, this, these ones are just kind of like all the blues. have like this um, wicker basket with like a white lining on it and I just kind of have my sneakers so I have a few Converse and a few I uh, have my coach um, just like um, slip on shoes and then I have a couple H&M ones that are like that nice green color and then behind that I have a Bath and Body Works bag that just has um, extra refill wallflowers for my uh, the scent of my room. So we just looked at my uh, sneakers and stuff that are in that corner so now I have a um, shoe shelf. Um, it's actually two of the same ones but I can't fit heels in these shelves because they're too small. So the bottom one's just pulled forward a little bit and then this one I just pushed all the way back so that I could fit these two shoes here. Here I have a few more heels and these ones are just kind of like miscellaneous like random heels really. Um, and then I have another thing of like flats um, and then I have um, these random heels and like these really small heels that I wear in the winter just because it kind of gives you a little bit of lift without them being too high so they're really convenient for like school and stuff um, and then I have some more flats and then more flats um, and then if I move this down 
on like the bottom part here I also have some more heels going all the way down the bottom part of my closet and shelf that I got from I think it would be oh these one um and the shoe shelf and this one that has the sweaters in it I think they're from Walmart or like Canadian Tire or one of those places um but yeah these ones are just kind of like the white ones and the gray ones I just kind of kept them here because this is the way I had them before um, and then I just kind of kept them here instead of pushing them all the way up to the top just because I have the room down here So I have this Little box in there and then okay. How lame am I? I have this um, like 17 prom book um, That from when I was a, when I went to uh, prom when I was in like high school and then I have the um, 17 prom magazine version of the one that went from when I was in high school so I just kept it because I thought it'd be fun when I'm older to have this still so now this box um, oh and these are all from Ikea I got the one the shoe thing the flats thing from Ikea and this one is from Ikea as well um, and this one just has like all of my like bikinis and stuff which I really should store in the basement but since I have the room I just kind of keep it here so I have another one of these boxes and it's just like giant um, and this one just stores all of my scarves and my hats um, and then this one which is another it's the same collection from Ikea and it just has all of like my gloves and stuff in there so I just keep that on top and then this orange one just has all of like my fur um, collars and faux fur, faux fur collars and stuff and then on this very very end corner I have a random orca from SeaWorld because fun fact favorite animal orca um, and then I have my puppy that my first boyfriend ever ingredient gave me it's like the cutest thing ever so I just keep it in there just because it's like so cute um, and then I have some slippers that my boyfriend gave me, which are sock monkeys, because I love sock monkeys. And then I have these little princess slippers that look like this, and they're just kind of like silky. I usually use these in the spring. Um, and then I have two of my, like, long boots that have my DIY uh, boot stands. So I have two of those ones in the front, and then I have another one, like, in the, near the back. Um, and then I have, like, this giant bag of, like, random like shopping bags just because I carry stuff to school all the time so I just kind of keep them in there. I hope you guys liked how I organized my closet and found it at least a little bit helpful and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!